welcome back to my channel so for today's video i'm going to be showing you my makeup collection so let's get into the video so i'm just going to show you what my makeup collection looks like it's currently snowing outside which is really cool but on the top we have brushes and then down here is just the drawers so one two four of the drawers actually don't have makeup in so i'm only going to be showing you five drawers with makeup in so let's just show you okay so like i said on the top we have brushes so um i actually not la not this december last december 2020 i got the james charles makeup brushes here they are well not these ones these ones and obviously they come with a pot and i basically separate them out so these are my james charles morphe brushes these are my like taller brushes um that look good in this and then we have my non-branded kind of brushes like they are branded but not James Charles so Technique um, these are BH Cosmetic ones so those are my brushes and then back here we just have some micellar water so this one is obviously running out so I got the bigger one I always get the big ones just because they last a good amount of time so let's start with the first drawer so i'm just going to open it gently so it doesn't all move so in the first drawer also obviously i don't have like tons and tons of makeup just a small little collection that's good for me um i'm guessing it will grow in the future but for now this is like a good amount for me so over here we have some setting spray from revolution then we have some Barry M primer, then we have some Revolution primer, and some Rimmel primer. Then over here we have my Conceal and Define foundation, along with my Conceal and Define concealer, and my Super Size Conceal and Define concealer. Then we have my Collection Long Lasting Perfection concealer. And my Makeup Obsession Mega Conceal. Then I have my sample of my NARS foundation. And then we have just my Beauty Blenders over here. Which you can never have too many Beauty Blenders. The next section is all my powders, bronzers, blush, stuff like that. So this is probably like my favourite drawer. Just because of how it looks. So over here we have my Mislin um products. So here's my Mislin bronzing and contouring powder in the shade Vitamin C. This is really nice. I don't actually use it that much anymore, but it is really nice. And then we have my Mislin um Love You Peach and Everyday, which is this is hard to do with one hand surprise surprise peach this is really nice it's also quite shimmery you can't really see on camera but this is good for the like more natural looks and i love how it's like magnetic and it kind of opens like a book then we have my be my flamingo forever this is such a pigment and blush it's honestly beautiful there i am <laughs> So this one is a bit more matte, still I've used it a little bit, but yeah I really like this one, it's very pink. And then here's my Ofra highlighter, which I absolutely love. It's the shade in Glazed Donut by Nikki Tutorials, super shimmery, super pigmented and I just love it. Then we have my Made by Mitchell blushes. So this is the first one. It's Shady Business. And it doesn't want to focus. So this one is a really good um, bronzer, liquid bronzer. And then we have my liquid blush, which is in the shade.
Posy Rosy. There we go, got it to focus. And they're really good as well. I feel like they will last me in quite a while. Then over here I have my only powder. I do want to get some more powders, like um pressed powders, but at the minute this is the only one I have, so it's the iHeart Revolution Coconut Powder. This is actually really good. I've had this for about a year, oops, a year and a bit and look how much is left. There's so much left. And it also comes with one of them applicator things, which is really good for when I'm drawing down my eyebrows for when I do my makeup looks. Then we have my Revolution Pro Highlighting Set, which is in the shade Ice. These are really good as well. This is more of a blue one, gold one and the pink one. I think my favourite is probably the blue one. Just because it's very like icy and if you've got a lot of warmth on, on your face this can kind of turn it down a little bit. And then I've got my Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer which smells really good. And this is also a really nice bronzer. This is more of a light coverage so if you only want like a little bit you just get a little dab of this. And it's really really nice. And then this is my highlighting cosmetics um dream glow kit which is also really nice if i can open it there we go okay so the next draw is my mascaras and eyeliners so I actually don't really use these lashes, um, just because I can't, I don't know how to put them on. Um, but those are them, my mum gave me them. And then I have my eyelash curler, which I probably need to get a new one of these because this one is very uh, destroyed. And then we have my NYX liners, which I'm really sad that they've um, not selling these anymore because I do really enjoy using these. Um, I got these for Christmas last year. 2020 from my brother he got me the white and the black one and then we have my maybelline sky high mascara which is probably one of the best mascaras i've used it's really really nice makes my lashes long and nice and dark and then here we have my number seven lash extender mascara which is actually really good as well and then we have my big lash volume mascara which is good for volume and then this one this one it's not the best i usually do this for like really natural because it kind of just adds some color it that's all it really does add some color to my lashes this is a mini version of this one um which can be used for travel and then i have my eyebrow gel which i actually just use for before i put mascara on and you can see on my eyelashes which is really gross but yeah, that was like two pounds or something. So this drawer has all my lipstick kind of stuff. So in here, I just have some collection lip bar, lipstick, lip gloss, some lip balm, and then all my Vaseline's. And then here I have my clear lip glosses, my number seven lipsticks, and my NYX Milky Gloss in. Um, cookies and milk. There we go. So that's that draw. Now let's move on to uh, kind of like the last draw. So this is my eyeshadow draw, which is probably my favourite one. So I have all these palettes. I have my Made by Mitchell palette. My Morphe uh, 35B palette, my Morphe 35I palette, which took ages to get, my Be Perfect Candle Free Love TE palette, my uh, Be Perfect Carnival Extra Large Pro palette, and then I have my James Charles palette, which I'm sure you, most of you know what that looks like by now. And then back here, I have my EYN Bright Matte palette. Nude Matte Palette, Fiery Matte, and Berry Matte, and then I have my Jordan Lipskin 
um, Onyx palette, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. And then I have my Revolution purple palette. And then down here, oops. And then down here, I just have all my Fuel Louise faces, which I actually bought these when they were selling out. So I got them all for £50. And then I just got these ones for Christmas. And then in this drawer, I just have all my Snazaroo and my Meron uh, kind of face paints. So, yeah, I kind of just keep these in a random drawer with my makeup. Cotton pads, I've got my eye uh, glue stick, a toothbrush, which I use for like on my hair and stuff. And then some wipes. So, this drawer is a bit random, but. Um, I don't really know where else to put my face paints except in here, so yeah. Okay guys, so that is my makeup collection. I really hope you enjoyed today's video, and I will see you in my next one. Bye!